Hi guys! Hi! It's the Madeline and Mommy Show and we're back. Yep. And this is Mad Spa episode. Mm -hmm. um, you want to tell the listeners a little bit about what you've been up to? A lot lately. Um, there's going to be a spa segment. There's going to be my mom doing a spa segment. There's going to be lots of different stuff. Yeah, we have some cool stuff planned, and we've been filming throughout the spring. So um, we didn't forget about all of our fans. We love you all very much. Please don't forget about us. Go to our YouTube channel and give us a thumbs up because we need more subscribers, okay? And we hope you enjoy well, you the show. you got to subscribe for more subscribers. Well, it's true, right? That's true. So we hope you enjoy the show. So we're here at Peace of Mind Spa, and I think I'm going to get a relaxation facial today. So Hi, Madeline. Hi. I'm Shay. So nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. All right, so I'm just going to have you come over here. Here's where you'll want to sign in, and then after you sign in, I'm going to have you sit down and you'll fill out this information card. Okay. Hi, my name is Madeline Patrick. I'm your lifetime star reporter, and I'm here with... Shay, what are you doing here today? I did on you a facial. I do offer facial services such as microneedling. I also do microblading for eyebrows. Um, just a number of different things. Just depends if the person's looking for relaxation or anti-aging. Can you tell me a little bit about here? Uh, yeah, this is in downtown, downtown Safety Harbor, so it's very nice. Um, very quaint little downtown, easy to get around. And in and, and the spa, we offer facials, we offer massage, reflexology. Um, can you tell us where we can find you on the internet? At Skincare Solutions by Shay. How long have you been doing this? I've been doing it for eight years. I've had my own place here for three. Oh, how can we get an appointment here? You can find me on Instagram or Facebook at Skincare Solutions by Shea, or you can text me at 787-308-9071. Thank you so much for being here today. Goodbye. Bye. All right, how's that feel? Okay, not too hot? All right, if it starts to get too hot, just let me know, okay? That's the steam. Mm-hmm. How's it feel, Madeline? So I'm going to do a mask. This is a pumpkin and papaya mask. Lots of vitamins. It's nice and exfoliating. Some people do experience a little bit of tingling with this just because it's exfoliating. Um, so that's normal, but if it ever feels uncomfortable, just let me know. Okay. Aromatherapy oil and some of it is like a eucalyptus lemongrass. Yeah. It's okay? Not too hot? No. I can smell the lemongrass, it smells great. It's like our bar of soap, Madeline. <laughs> Just got a whole drawer full of aromatherapy over there. I like it. Put that mask come off nice and easy. Oh yeah, especially with the steam going. You can always already see her cheeks are nice and rosy. She's got a nice glow. And we're gonna do some oxygen on you before you leave, and that'll give you a really nice. Oh wow, so that's the oxygen. I'm just going to really work it in there.
so it's just straight oxygen. Uh, there's also a serum that goes in there yeah. so that that ox uh, oxygen shakes it. I can't say that word. <laughs> Okay, so today I'm going to be doing the, the spa treatment on my mom. I'm going to be doing this Starburst Glitter Mask on her. It's a charcoal mask. So it comes with the silicone applicator and the, the formula, obviously. Ooh, that's cool looking. It's all like purpley and glittery it's black. and black. It's it's cool. And it's already mixed up, so you just apply it. There's baby wipes over there if you need them. Is my hair out of my face? I tried to pull it back. If this pulls your hair out, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. And this is a peel off mask, right, yeah. Madeline? Yes, it is. It's a peel off face mask. It does kind of hurt, but it's fine. It kind of hurts? Work, oh, we yeah. have to let it dry on there really good before you peel it yeah, off. It does really you have to make sure not to put it on too thick. It burns after a while. Does it pull your skin tight? Um, it doesn't pull really bad. It just it burns <laughs> and it'll burn your eyes right now. But we don't want to get it in our eyes. Well, it's not going to go in your eyes, but since it's alcohol based, it's going to start making your alcohol eyes water. Alcohol based, so it'll feel kind of tingly? It'll make your eyes water. And we're actually, um, okay. This stuff does pull out hair, so try not to get this in your hair. You're pretty good at this though, and you've been doing some makeup. We're going to do some makeup tutorials with you here pretty soon. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I might do a like cute little makeup tutorial first, or I'll do a Visco girl makeup tutorial. One of one of more. Hey, this stuff is cold. Yeah. How do I look? It is. Ooh. You're not supposed to look yet. Oh, sorry. This is a spa treatment. It's the spa treatment. Are your eyes watering? I can't wait to eat some of that pizza that you made. Oh my goodness. It smells good. This pizza does smell good. This doesn't smell like anything. It kind of does to me. From where I'm at, from applying it, like, it's... You can smell it? Yeah. What's it smell like to you? Like charcoal. Like, charcoal? Like on a grill charcoal, like that kind. My face smells like a grill. No, the stuff that I'm putting on it does. I don't smell it though. How do I look, guys? Mom, I said no looking yet. Can you put your head down? I wasn't. Down? I was showing them. Can you put your head down? Head down. Because we have a viewfinder, so you're going to be able to see it. You guys ever wonder what camera we use? To use? We use a Canon. We do use a Canon now. Oh, my goodness. This works pretty good, though. That applicator works really well. It feels kind of strange when you put it on. I like it. It's smooth. It's a lot of glitter, which I don't know if it's good for you or not, but you know, it's pretty, it's all that counts, right? Here, let me get this hair off my forehead. Not a problem, I got this. Okay, I'm not trying to get this in your eyebrows, so we're gonna I don't care. Are you sure you want no eyebrows? Yeah, I don't want no eyebrows. I wanna keep my eyebrows. Okay. I don't draw mine on. Do that nice and smooth across the top. Maybe it'll get rid of all the wrinkles. Mm, I don't. No, not that lucky? Mm, nah, this is not that kind of mask. Oh boy. I have to put some moisturizer on after this. Or like a physical. Oh, no! Hold on a second. Well, my hair is getting into it. There we go. How are we doing here? Oh my. Wait, you're just doing your nose? Yeah, I'm only doing that. That's hilarious. That's where I have the most, um, Nick. Yeah. What? 
You don't get any of us? I, not as many as I used to, no. So now I'm just filling in her, uh, like the areas where there's not a lot. And yeah, I missed her chin a little bit earlier. And there's a little too much. And that's pretty much it for hers. And all I did for mine was my nose. She just did her nose. <laughs> look, how do I look, guys? I don't know how oh, looks. Madeline did a good job. She did a really good job. She's just doing her nose. I think I'm good now. So, yeah. Whoa. All right, now so we now we have to let this dry. 15, look, there's a fan over there. Two, 20 hand, to 30 minutes. Hand me the fan. Maybe this will speed up the process. Mm, I had to wait like 40 minutes last time I did this. So, so I guess cold. we'll be back. Ooh, it's getting tight. My nose is so cold. It makes your nose cold. cold. Ooh, man. Whoa. Ooh. That feels good. And while we wait, we're going to be doing a candy review. Yeah, so we'll be so back. So first thing for this candy review that I'm going to be doing is this Sherbert, the Rainbow Sherbert Ring Pop. And also, I'm going to be opening up this little... Um, bag of candy that I got for my birthday from my friends John, John, and Nicole. So first thing I'm gonna open up is this ring pop. Is it sour? No, it's the rainbow sherbet. Oh. Oh, it looks good. Pretty. Rainbow sherbet, or just orange sherbet? Rainbow. What does it taste like? Orange? It tastes like... <laughs> it tastes good for a second, like like lemons, but then it's like minty. Ew. What in the world? And ring pops are usually really yummy. Thanks, what flavor was that? Rainbow sherbet. Rainbow sherbet. Do not recommend. Would not buy again. Oh. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, so this is like a bag of goodies. So I'm just going to undo this little red tie, which is kind of easy to do because it just knots. Okay, so I have that off. And then Nicole, I'm betting you, I don't think John knows me now. Nicole made me a little bracelet. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's nice. Mm hmm And... It has two gold beads on it. Oh, like so sweet. And then a Z for... And a pretty flower. I don't know what Z... What is a Z for? I don't know. Well, something special. And then two flowers. Very nice. And then this little green oval bead. Okay. And this little... Okay, so now I'm gonna open up her. Oh, I'm just gonna do a mystery. Fair enough. A mystery? It's a sucker. I got a cherry dum dum. Just dump it out and see what else she gave you. What is that? Lemon head. Oh, lemon heads. Which are berries? Uh, those are sour. Oh, we already ate some. <laughs> I did not. That's hilarious. Some healthy snacks? Never mind that. So there is some Black Forest mini gummy bears. There's like, there's five Black Forest mini gummy bears. And okay. I'm trying these because I've never had that. And then there is this mystery dum dum. There's a green apple dum dum, a pineapple dum dum, which I'm gonna try this too, and then another pineapple dum dum, a cherry one, and like a pineapple banana pear, like a fruity one. So try the mystery one. Okay, so we're gonna do mystery first. I'm gonna see the contents. It says. It's probably sugar. The mystery flavor is a secret. You can guess the flavor. Oh, it doesn't say the contents. Okay, it's red, so I think I know what it is already. It 
Lisa Terry. It's a mystery? <laughs> That's no mystery. And now, <laughs> I'm going to try the pineapple. Okay, now you have to put that one. Okay. And I like pineapple. I've never had this. It says, save wraps. Oh, if you save the wrappers, you can get stuff. Okay. Oh, this is the original pineapple wrap. Nice. It tastes like a pineapple and then like sugary. So it's like from a pineapple to sugar to like more sugar to like like a fruity ending. Okay. So now, Interesting. I would like to see you try one of those yeah, lemon heads. No, I'm going to try the blackberry. The, forest, the black, black forest. forest. Gummies. Gummy bears. I've never had those. Have you? Oh, no. Cool. Oh, we'll have to try that. So I'm going to try out one. They gave me a bunch of bags. So, if I like them, I'll eat them. Oh. Okay, so I'm going to try a red one first. Oh, they're really tiny. Yummy. How cute. They're made with real fruit juice. They're healthy ones. Any good? Mm -hmm. If you guys didn't know, I'm vegan now. She's mm -hmm. trying. This is like her first day. She's on a diet, so she's trying to be a vegetarian. Oh. I'm not vegan anymore. <coughs> Delton is not vegan. Uh, okay, I'm going to try an orange one now. This is clear. I don't know what this is. This looks clear. Good. My favorite color is clear. Just kidding. What grade are you going into? Sixth grade. Oh my goodness. I can't even believe it. Now I can try an orange one. Orange is my favorite. Orange? Yeah, it tastes like normal gummy bears. They're really good. Okay. Okay. So that was fun. So now. So one more thing, and that is the lemon heads. The chewy oh, they're lemon chewy heads. lemon heads. So they have a raspberry lemon head, wild cherry, watermelon, and strawberry. Which I'm pretty immune to sour stuff, so. I'm not. We all know that. Okay. So it looks like I have a, a watermelon. Oh, nice. And they're chewy. Mm -hmm. So it's a sour watermelon. Good. They're very sour. Those are all sour watermelons? Mm -mm. I'm going to try all the flavors because I think they have all the flavors in here. But I don't see a lemon one in there. Because there's no lemon flavor. That's hilarious. Chewy lemon heads. There's no lemon flavor. For the chewy lemon heads. Okay. Now I'm going to try strawberry because that's my favorite. Mm. It's good. I can't put my finger on what this tastes like. It's supposed to be a chewy lemon head. It's really super good. The strawberry is the best out of the ones. Is it sour? Mm-mm. Nice. And then, I don't know. Is there a difference? That looks great. Try the darker one. Is there a difference? Yes. Okay, so this is wild cherry and this is raspberry. Gotcha. Okay, so I like cherry, so I'm going to try that first. Oh my god. That is delicious. Really good. Oh wow. So you highly suggest the chewy lemon heads. Even though there's not one single lemon head in there. I don't suggest the watermelon one. Okay. I don't like that. But the other flavors are yummy? I haven't tried the raspberry. Awesome. This is the raspberry. Oh, it's a little sour? <laughs> it's not. It's not just that sour. The taste 
It sort of tastes like soap. Ew. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but, wow. And, yeah. Mm. Oh. Mm. Okay. Well, very good candy review. I don't suggest the watermelon nor the raspberry. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh, off her mat. Ah. Home. Oh. Ah. Ooh, it's painful. Ow. Oh, it feels like you're tearing off my skin. Ah. Ah. Oh. What the? Ow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Did it? Ah! Woo! This is as bad as waxing. Ah! Oh! We're satisfied for the person that's peeing. Oh! Oh my goodness! Ah! Ow! Oh! Took a chunk of my eyebrow. He said. Your eyebrows are thin. Oh my goodness. Wait, I'm almost done. Your eyebrows are thin. I gotta get your forehead. Her eyebrows are very thin, so I didn't get any on her eyebrows. No eyebrows were harmed in the making of this video. <coughs> wow. Only the top half is done. Ah! Ow! This is Stop torture. Stop crunching your nose. Torture. Uh, ah! Ow! Come wow! Woo! <laughs> oh my goodness! I Take think I want to wash the rest of it off. Two, three, three. Ah! Ah! Come. Woo! Oh! If you wash it off, I won't take the zits off. Oh my goodness! I I think I just rather would rather. You don't want to take your zips off. Look at me. Holy All right, this is I good. I need your full attention, mommy. Ow. Okay, very nice. I can get right there, too. Ready? Oh. Three, two, one. Whoa. Ah. Huh? Woo. Damn. It looks like you're shedding. So she'll pick off the pepperoni, and then we're gonna be doing mozzarella and spinach pizza for the second one. Also, before we get started, just make sure you wash your hands so that you don't get any germs in your food, because I just did. So now we're just gonna cut open the bag of pizza dough. So now we're just peeling it off of the um. The plastic. Looks like slime. I know. That's what I said. <laughs> and unless you get it all off the plastic, which I didn't do. And we can buy this dough in the store. Yes, we just bought it from the store. So you want to use like the palm of your hand and push it down to move it around? It's really sticky. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to use my fingers. you got to push on it like slime. Mm -hmm. So we got it spread out and now we're just pushing on the edges so that it covers the whole pan. And now that we've done that, we're just going to dump the pizza sauce on. And I actually need a spoon for this part. So, so now we're just spreading around the sauce. Mm, that smells good already. Oh, yeah. 
it smells like pizza, pretty much. The whole, like, You don't want to get it on your pizza, edge of your crust, just in the middle. Yeah, I know. The whole smell of pizza is sauce. Like, it's not the actual... It's the crust, too. It's like baked bread. It's amazing. Everything about pizza. The cheese. Mmm. Well... If Yummy. You can't have it, just use the gluten recipe. Well, there's different ways of making pizza, so this is one way we're going to demonstrate. We're going to demonstrate another way here in a minute. Too. Okay. So now we have that down, we're going to put the cheese on. We don't want to put too much because we're making two pizzas. So All right, we're not make making sure you a double it. cheese. You got plenty of cheese there for both. Too. Oh, there's tons of cheese there. You like plenty of cheese on my pizza. That's the best part of the pizza. The best part of the pizza is the pizza. It's the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Yummy. It looks good. So now we're going to put the pepperonis on, which we're doing a half and half for this one. So we're going to do half cheese, half pepperoni. Oh, wow. Might want to put a little extra cheese on one side when mm -hmm. you get done. We're going to make it look realistic, so we're not going to put it everywhere. We love pepperoni. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then put a little cheese on the other side. Mm -hmm. Make it extra cheesy. Put some Parmesan on top of it. My mom can't have pepperoni. I can't. So That's right. I'm making cheese. Put a little Parmesan. Well, I'm going to dig into some of that spinach pizza when we make that. Whoa, exciting. All right. Very nice. Yeah, kind of spread it around with your fingers. There you go. That looks great. Now I'm going to put it in the oven. How warm is your oven, Madeline? 375. 375. I put it to 400, but that's what we came up with. It's 375. Look at that pizza. There it goes in the oven. Careful. Nice and hot. All right. That'll be done in about 12 to 15 minutes. We'll be back. So now we are just... Pushing down the edges on this pizza. And first things first, we're going to put the Alfredo sauce on it instead of the pizza sauce. Because this is like, this is almost like vegetarian pizza, right? You need more than that, sweetheart. There you go. And I need a spoon again. So this is actually a little bit more smooth to like move around um, because it's like more connected. Just don't get it too close to the edge. It doesn't actually have tomatoes or anything, so that's why I think it's like not separating at all. It's just Alfredo sauce. Yummy, yum, yum. And that's pretty much it for that. So now we're just going to put the cheese on. So for the cheese, I'm going to put the same amount on the Spread that cheese around. Make sure you put plenty of cheese on there. Are you going to put the spinach? No? Spinach. You're going to do spinach next and then cheese on top? Uh-huh. Nice. Okay, so that's good, I think. Yep, okay. and I already washed the spinach and took the stems off of it. So spread that. Don't be shy with that spinach either. Well, I don't like a lot of spinach. I love spinach. So now we're putting the cheese on top of the spinach. Mmm. And then we're going to put fresh mozzarella on it. Ah, uh, yeah. My favorite. Fresh mozzarella. Don't be shy with those little mozzarella balls. Mmm. Spread them around. Mm -hmm. You may end up using the whole container on that. That's fine. Wow. It smells. It's just mozzarella. That's good. So now we're going to put this pizza in the oven. Ooh, let me see it. That looks fantastic. <laughs> and check on your other pizza too, huh? It looks Let's almost see. really done, actually. Oh the, my gosh, it's almost done. The crust isn't ready, though. You no, it's not. All right, close the oven door. So here's the first finished one, and I'm going to try a piece of it. Mm -hmm. It looks amazing. Mm -hmm. Good stuff? Mm-hmm. And the dough is really good too. Nice. Very nice. Which one was that? Pepperoni? Uh huh. Excellent. We're back and here's the second pizza. 
super hot, right? Really good. That's the spinach? Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh. I didn't really get a lot of spinach. That thing looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm-hmm. You like it better than the other one? I go like the same. This one's a little bit better. Thank God. I can't wait to try it. Good job, sweetheart. Thank All right. You. You're welcome. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Wow. That was exciting. Uh -huh. You went to a spa and got the full treatment, and then you gave me the spa treatment. And man, so much exciting, fun stuff going on with Madeline and Mommy. So, also, don't forget we have some merchandise to sell. Uh huh. The t shirts are $10. The CDs are $15, right? Then there's kids and adult size t shirts. And there's also mouse pads that are $10. And yeah. And we can. Send them directly to you through PayPal. All you have to do is send your request to um, Mad Mommy Show 2015 at gmail.com, like the at symbol. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And that's it. So thank you so much for your continued support. We really, truly love all of our fans. And don't forget to tune in to our radio show every Monday from 4 to 6 p.m. on Unified Reach Network. Blog Talk Radio, Spotify, TuneIn, Stitcher, iTunes. I might have forgot a couple, but yeah. And uh, oh, by the way, happy belated birthday. Thank you. Somebody's 11 now. Yay! <laughs> so this is the part of the show where you sing. Facebook, Instagram, Google Plus, and Twitter. It's the Madeline and Mommy Show. Woo! Facebook, Instagram, Google Plus, and Twitter. It's the Madeline and Mommy Show. Woo! Mostly Madeline.